Hi everyone, today I'm going to show you how to create radio bar using my template. The template is an easier way to create complex chart or custom chart. I'm going to show you how to create radio bar in this video. Radio bar is just like bar chart. It has a dimension called name and another measure that is called a value. Everything else is derived fields, okay, like a calculated field. So this is the original data, okay, one dimension and one measure, name and value. So let's add, say, our own data source, super store, okay. First step, edit data source, and we are going to union the data set with itself. Say here, we are going to union orders table with others table. Then let's go back and um, say we are going to show the subcategory sales in the radio bar chart. Then we need to rename subcategory as name and the sales as value. Voila. This is the second step, renaming two fields, name and value. The third is to replace the data source by, by Superstore. Okay. If it's your data source, then it's going to you need to replace source by your data source. Okay. And, uh, you know, it's almost there. We just need to adjust the width of the bar, the size of the bar, to make it a little nicer. Voila, that's it. Okay, so here it is, our new radio bar chart. Thanks for watching.